Hello again, welcome to the Friday Wrap for October 24th. I decided to do it outside today because I could. One of the last few, day, few uh, real nice uh, weather days we're, we're probably going to have this year. Overall, it was a pretty quiet week in the village. Uh, here's, here is here is an update of what happened around the, around town. Uh, the Burr Ridge Bank and Trust uh, Community Appreciation Day was held last weekend. Uh, the plan commission meeting was uh, canceled uh, this week. Uh, the Tri-State Fire District Recognition Dinner was also postponed. Uh, as far as uh, the upcoming election on the uh, on uh, I'm sorry in April. Right now, the, the packets are available for those people who want to run for trustee. Uh, there, there are three positions uh, open, uh, and uh, there are eight, a total of eight packets that have been pulled so far. Uh, the board this week, also the board summary of the board goals and priorities uh, was, was finalized. If you'd like to see that, that's available online. And if I could figure out how to attach this email or, or uh, make it available in the Friday wrap, I'll do so. Uh, the board, there is a board meeting scheduled for this Monday. Uh, it is a, a very light agenda that's scheduled. Uh, we may even have a special presentation by the Soaring Eagle Academy, uh, who was in my office uh, this week. Uh, hopefully they'll, they'll, they'll be, able to be available on Monday to give additional information about their organization, which is growing at a pretty rapid pace, uh, and their fundraiser they have in November. Uh, now, the reason I'm filming it uh, from here uh, is to highlight the uh, Fall Festival, which we held on Saturday. It's actually sponsored by the Village Center. Uh, they have all kinds of, all kinds of neat events, uh, such as, let's see, they have... A uh, trick or treat, hay rides, uh, stilt walkers. They have an they have an umpa band, which will be uh, playing back there. Uh, food and drinks, tons of fun. Uh, kids of, for kids of, of all ages, and certainly uh, adults will have fun as well. And at two o'clock, uh, Jim Peterick will be right over here by the, at Barbara's bookstore, uh, doing a book signing for his book he's he's written to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the Ides of March. I really hope you can you can attend the fall festival, especially Jim Peterick's uh, special book signing. Uh, that's got to be an historic event because so few bands uh, in the in the world ever last that 50 years. Uh, so uh, come out and enjoy enjoy the weekend.